Hi guys, so I had this experience with a customer around two weeks ago, so I just want to talk about it. So this customer ordered a 14-inch water wave headband wig from me, which was a $13,000. However, she got free delivery, so you know, all of that covered. Okay, fine. It was cash and delivery, to be exact, in halfway three. So three to four days after receiving the hair, she's going to message me, oh, the wig cannot fit. So me being the person I am, I'm like, okay, let me do an exchange. And then if when I give you a larger cap, then it still cannot fix, then I'll consider a refund. She agreed upon that. But way before that, um, she messaged me. I was not near the phone, so I took a long time to reply. Get a note of the lady, make her man text me. And I go, oh, my girlfriend, buy a wig, yada, 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 whatever, whatever. I angle it professionally. Okay. By, by I saw his message, I already replied to her. So I'm like, I'm in communication with her and all that, whatever. He said, okay, that's fine. And, um, you know, proceed to there. So, you know, we schedule a time and we will do the refund, um, the exchange. So I made sure she got a cap that was two size bigger than the original one that she got. Come, no wonder what it comes to me say, oh, it's mal again. Because me, me not have money for it. I'm trying to make money. I ain't got money, time and the money to be refunding things, right? So give a bear the new hair, all that. Same time when the bear reach her. My phone start ringing. It's my bearer saying, oh, no, not even whole. It's when I answered the phone, it was she on the phone saying, oh, the wig cannot fit. I want a refund. I want a refund. I want a refund. At first, like, I was on the road. So I'm like, whenever they relate to, I think about things. So I said, okay, I will issue a refund. It was on the Saturday, right? So I told her that it will have to be a Monday evening or Tuesday. Okay, fine. Um, Sunday come around, she texted me, oh, what time Monday, what time Monday? I said, it will be Monday evening or Tuesday. And then I said, and then I said, um, it will be Tuesday to be exact. Okay, no problem. The bearer of the package. So, however, I wanted to get that package because um, I wasn't going to issue a refund. I'm going to put it on the next bigger cap because I know that it can fit her because I double the size of the cap and all that. So, I know what I'm putting out. So, she's saying it cannot fit and wanting a refund and just a demand a refund and all that. I'm like, that's a red flag. I mean, say, and I was on the road and I made a decision and told her that, okay, she would um, receive a refund. Okay, she's so well happy and all that. So I told the bearer, I live in the country area. So I tell the bearer, I say, okay, give X and X, whatever, whatever. Get the package back to me. I got the package. Wait, my dear one, I'm going to go for the wig and show you. This girl wore the wig. He, she even curl it out or comb it out and I use satin and all that. Destroy the fucking wig. And I'm going to come demand a refund. Let me go for the wig and come back. Oh, this is the fucking wig. Like, what is this? What is this, honey? What is that? How can you just try on a wig and you realize, okay, it cannot fit, and it's, it's in this blood clot state? In this state? Make it make fucking sense. So, Monday morning, Tuesday morning, my bearer woke me up some minutes to six. So the girl called. 